About 7,000 SMEs have applied to defer over $10 billion worth of loans since Singapore's central bank rolled out support measures last April. Individual borrowers as well as businesses in sectors hit hardest by the pandemic will get a final reprieve. They now have at least three more months to apply for schemes to help with loan repayment. Heidi Ng reports. Businesses like these are bearing the brunt of the pandemic's impact on the economy. And that's why MES and the financial industry are giving them more time to apply for help to pay off their loans. These apply to firms in hospitality, transport, arts and entertainment and also some retailers. The schemes, which had already been extended once, were set to close for applications in June. We want to be able to help those who still need cash flow, but this will be the final extension. The good thing is that uh, the first extension that we did, okay, that extended the relief or the re credit relief from January to June, uh, actually has uh, seen a dramatic drop in the numbers. This sharp reduction suggests that the need for this credit relief is not so wide. Eligible SMEs will have until 30th September to apply to defer 80% of their principal payments. All SMEs with more than one lender and don't qualify for other schemes will have until 31st of December to request to restructure their loans across different banks. One business association says the move will help those hit by the recent period of tightened restrictions. Many of them actually found that it, it was worse than during the circuit breaker because of the, the lack of um, you know, government support and help. And many were continued, had to continue to open and pay salaries and rental, right? And uh, there wasn't any business and, and you know, everyone is encouraged to stay at home. So for many, this one month has been really, really tough, especially, you know, in the retail and f and sector. As for individuals, those whose incomes have been affected will have until 30th September to apply for reduced property loan installments. They'll also be able to convert their outstanding credit balances to term loans at a reduced interest rate. They may also extend loan tenures for debt consolidation plans by up to five years and renovation and student loans by up to three years. MES says those who still have difficulty resuming loan repayments after the relief periods should approach their lenders.